or this is another way that Star Wars is appealing to, to the people and Star Wars expanding. I mean, why not? I think they are great clothes, for the, except, except, except for that yellow jacket that Luke wore. Not sure about that, but <laughs> apart from that, <laughs> there are some great costumes and great clothes, especially in the prequels. I just came from the Star Wars exhibition where they have a lot of those pieces there. And if you see them close up, it's actually amazing how much thought um, and how much creative energy has gone into creating these pieces. So I can't wait to see Finn's inspi inspired wear. That'll be really, really fun to see. It, it, feels, it feels great. My melanin works well with lights and uh, that's always a good thing. Uh, but I am very appreciative. I'm very, um, I'm very happy, genuinely happy. Um, and that's something that isn't easy to have at this moment in time because it's such a crazy, crazy roller coaster. There's quite frankly no clarity on how I feel, but now, right now, I'm, I'm happy, and that's the most important thing. They do. I think actually they always have. Um, Star Wars has definitely set trends since it um, was first made all those years ago, and it will continue to do so. What's it like to be a part of this world now? It's pretty amazing. It's uh, it's above and beyond anything I could have imagined. Like I was just like, right, I'm going to do a film, and then it's like a film plus all of the other things. So it's um, it's crazy how far it spreads in pop culture, but great to be part of it. Ah, it feels pretty cool. I mean, I'm really excited to be a part of Star Wars and to be meeting fans and being a part of everyone who's geeking out. Uh, you probably already know what I can tell you. She's a pirate and uh, she has a colorful past and uh, yeah, that's about it. <laughs>